We're right back to where we started. And we're heading to uh, destroy parentage. Parentage's equipment. Gonna interfere with ours. So you can't interact with any of this stuff. Architecture remains unaltered, and things are no longer wholly new to me. The dangerous experiences of youth, it turns out, weren't so dangerous. And the retirement plan will never come. I think if man's creations could withstand the destructive oh. force of time, I would still carry certain aspirations. There's a there's a motor boat here. I don't remember that being there before. Oh. Hey, Shelley, I want to know more about parentage. Oh, hey, Riley. I, I just finished the skunk spill. Okay, parentage. I mean, this is secondhand off someone who smelled like they were carved from gin, but still. So I guess parentage goes back like centuries, and a good few of them. There was this freak lightning storm once what? over Edwards Island, just out of nowhere. This was right in the middle of a wicked drought, so as soon as lightning touched ground, everything caught on fire. And every one. Hundreds of skeletons. Whoa. At least that they were able to count. Hard to get a proper number out of Ash. Over. Uh, so someone decided to make a religion out of this? Well, this is where it goes from bananas to nuts, depending on your definition. <laughs> Apparently, during that fire, this, like, thing showed up in the sky. Like this, I don't know, shape. The woman was mighty slurry at this point. Something opened in the sky and showed paradise on the other one of the, side. One of the because gates. Below it was an actual burning hell. A triangle, or... I don't know. She was just shy of intelligible. Over. Given what we've seen... Like of a tall tale. Fascinating. I was captivated. I mean, once I got past the belching every other sentence, a vision of paradise. Just that. There and gone. An open and shut door. Those who survived called that vision Planet Shine. And decided to form a group to oh. create it. Thus, parentage was born, with ash on their tongues. Over. How'd they get that name? Search me on that one. My mom is, like, weirdly obsessed with Frankenstein, so people are freaks, you know? The old lady told me that for, like, years and years after, they tried to recreate that night. As best they could. Oh. So, no lightning, but plenty of fire. And plenty of bodies. For years. Over. Some people didn't, you know, catch them in the act or something? That's interesting. I'm sure they did, and I'm sure they were set on fire. The long and short of it, it never happened again. The shape in the sky, I mean. Surprise, surprise. People dropped out, membership went kaput, the thing uh, ran its course. A couple of diehards, but no more, you know, bodies. No more sacrifices. No more ash. Over. Well, I mean, you say that, but what about the old lady? Clearly, not everyone changed their minds. Uh, yeah, you're not wrong. I don't know. There are people who think indoor plumbing is a mortal sin, so... You're always gonna find one hanger-on, I guess. Hmm. Seems colder out tonight. As far as I'm concerned, they're as dangerous now as they were then. Call me crazy, if you want. No, I... I won't. The old lady was drunk, but there's a difference between drunken delusion and belief. Her conviction was plenty sober. Anyway, don't believe everything you read. I'm getting a call, so see you when I hear you. Over and out. That's where that planet shine term came from. Talk to anyone else right now? Nick, it's Riley. You didn't sink, right? Hey there. Still floating. I appreciate the checkup. Water took a turn, though. Not a friendly one. We're not quite in Charlie Foxtrot territory, but you know, if the weather gets worse, I can still handle it, but. Uh. Hopefully, I'm the only idiot tooling around out here. Ah, uh, my dad was Air Force. Electrical engineering, though, not a pilot. Yep, you sniffed it. Served years back. And. Is this gate normally open? Oh, uh, not this late. Olivia might have beaten us here. Hmm. 
Whoops. Sorry, Nick. Brief interruption. <laughs> uh, continue, please. I want to hear this. I was Air Force, not Navy, so I wouldn't call myself an old salt. But I know water that shouldn't be trusted when I see it. Couldn't speak for the current state of the service, but when I was your age, everyone was itching for the fastest, shiniest bird in the coop. Everyone wanted to fly. Everyone. I wanted to explore. I wanted the shuttle. Let the flyboys have their pissing contest. I had my eyes elsewhere. Well, yeah, which kid didn't want to be an astronaut growing up? Over. Yeah, never grew out of it. Some, most, might argue I still haven't. But I was too tall, you see. They cap astronauts at six foot Whoa. Four. I'm over by a single inch. Tall boy. Genetics. What you gonna do? Not like I could cut my feet off. Though the thought had occurred. <laughs> That's really sad. I mean, come on. Surely they could extend the ceiling, right? And they didn't have room to fart in that shoebox. I can't blame them. Never quite shook the bug to, you know, stand somewhere no one else ever had. Yeah. That's why I bought the boat. So far, all I've found is seaweed and styrofoam. <laughs> anyway, thanks for the check-in. I'm heading further out to see if I can get a better view of it all. Reach out when you can. Make sure I haven't drowned. Over and out. Maybe, maybe he'll get that wish if he keeps messing around with uh, what's going on. Okay. I'm really digging this story. It's adding so much more to the to the first game. I think I'm enjoying it more. Okay, 2 a.m. than the first one because it's just. There seems to be a lot more going on under the surface. So used to checking the radio during around those rock formations. But that's all I have. Let's see if there's something there. Altered and things are no longer holy. It's the same thing every time. Quiet. Bottom of the twelfth. The baseball game. That which we can see, and that which we cannot see. Yeah. Life is an ocean of light. Heard that stuff before. Oops. Uh parentage welcomes you. It's kinda of hard to read. Uh Tonic. Tonic sermon? Seeing the third blue moon. Hmm. Moon reflects light. So we can see Hello? it. Hello? Okay, we're in the clear. So... If we're right, there's radio equipment around here somewhere. Let's just find it and destroy it before they get here. We can start upstairs, or just wander. Yeah, let's just look. We don't need to spend time making a game plan. Hey, you don't have to sell me. This is, uh, cool. The painting? Um, po Posidonius? Sounds like a Greek god. There's a number written on the edge here. 75.6? Sounds like a radio station. Yeah, but... Rock out for a bit. <laughs> Seems like a good time to do that. Pasadonius. There's three moons up there. Huh. Is this a, an altar or something? What's planet shine? God, I keep hearing that from, from Olivia, I think. They just explained it. <laughs> yeah, this is weird. It's funny. You see those symbols? Wait, I remember now. Those markings when we walked in. They looked so familiar. I've seen these around town a lot, and, and, and they always looked kind of, you know, amateurish. Like young people made them, and, and with a purpose and a sequence. I think it's how Olivia and them communicate, right? It's not just me. Are you saying that they copied these, or, or what? Uh, maybe. Mm. I, I just wonder what any of this has to do with. Well. 
still shimmering tonight? Yesterday evening, the world had its first glimpse of the far side of the moon. Are you saying they, they copied these? Or, or what? Oh, I hate when they do this. Let's just find that station equipment before anything uh, happens. Yeah, good call. Please, you know I'm gonna look everywhere. There's a star map here. And a lunar calendar too. It's hard to read. It's a pretty cheesy font for a cult. <laughs> Some of this looks Babylonian. They look like hieroglyphics. Basically the same as Sumerian. With some extra stuff tossed in. Oh, like you know what Babylonian looks like. Hey, don't be so surprised. I have a library card too, you know. With that stage. It is hard to imagine a cult putting on a stage show, but I guess anything's possible. Should we check this out or should we go upstairs? I don't know. We're going to go upstairs. I would say it looks like craft show art, but craft show art has more intensity. Oh, I thought that was a circle, like we could inspect it. So three different phases. Oh, that moon's looking awfully blue. <laughs> Imported from the finest chandeliers are us, I'm sure. Yeah, right, it's looking different. Hey, this looks like something. A cable running the length of the center? Looks like it's connecting something upstairs to something under us. The hidden laboratory, I presume? You know, unlock that door. Okay, I want to see what's up here first. Now let's go. Let's go. Oh. The specter of the mountains. I love cults, guys. Hey, Jacob, <laughs> you know what this thing is? I love reading about uh, cults. Inspector is a hallucination. Listening to podcasts, I should say. Phenomena thing. At the bottom, there's some art taped to it. Looks like children's drawings. That's weird. Is that weird? <laughs> Looks adorable, to tell you the truth. Yes, it kind of is adorable. <laughs> you know, Jacob, I have to say, I know we've seen some stuff tonight. Like, we've seen some stuff, but this, this isn't stuff. This is people who've taken stargazing past, you know, like what some people would call normal levels, but... But it's not really. Yeah. yeah I know what you mean. It's all just a little too... Um... Trying to find the right word. Too gemstony? Sure. Yeah, but... Uh, ah, whatever, so they're not evil. Or don't appear to be. Yeah, they still play bad music on Sundays, so let's find out where and rip out the circuitry. Yeah, I'm really intrigued by by cults and people that end up getting st stuck in them, uh, for lack of a better term. Like, I do, I, I do understand the um, idea of wanting to be part of something that's bigger than you. So, like, I, I, anyone, anyone could get caught up in something like that. No matter how, how smart you are, or how, um, I don't know, savvy you are. Well, found the antenna. Looks too sturdy to damage, honestly. Yeah, looks like it's from the 50s. Or 40s? A military tech from that era looked very similar. This stuff is made out of alloys that I ain't gonna bend. Let's find the control panel that works it. Goes down. I want to take a look at this some more. Strange kissa. Oh, oh! Ah. This is one of those. We we used to call them casters in the army. It's a radio with a broader range. It'll work on on that lock back in Garland. Radio locks. Oh, awesome! Upgrade. Okay, well I got I got to tune in to. Is this seventy four? Maybe it was 64? Yeah. 
Didn't we just... I've already forgotten. Evelyn's asked to check in with her whenever we play a transmitter. Stop blue ticks from running our transmitter array with the radio station. <laughs> Nick Nick needs a friend. Should stay in contact with him tonight, yeah. Oh, 75.6. There we go. That's oh, kind of off. No? Do I need to be outside? No coffee machine. Cool, guys. We go up another level? No, that's the end. Okay. Go down here. Oh, they're ladders. Can we get into that room from the other side? Yes. I think that cable tracks all the way to here. Something feels off about the floor. It feels hollow, right? Get that door open in case I have to run. We're going down. Ooh, look, see? This goes down to a basement. The lock looks strange. There's no keyhole or combo. I don't think I've seen anything like that before. How would they ever open it? Maybe this is yeah. what we... There's got to be a way in. Even if it's storage, they'll need to get it sometime. Yeah, this is what that Hard to argue. frequency is for. Aha! See? I knew the radio from upstairs would come in handy. There's a radio lock on the panel here. It's old military tech from like the 50s. They use alternate frequency RF signals to control the deadbolt. But we can use this radio with its broader range to tune in its code and unlock it. Um, theoretically. Oh yeah, I think Maggie actually had something to do with these. I'm, I'm not entirely sure though. Let's try it. That's the wrong button. Oops, paid it twice. Awesome. That's some fine radio unlocking. Yeah, great. Cross your fingers, there's not just a bunch of old blankets <laughs> down there. I think there's gonna be some crazy cult shit. Yeah, it's pretty, uh, pretty welcoming looking. We <laughs> have a vacuum. <laughs> oh, sorry. The dust is getting to me. Old, old school vacuum. But yeah, jackpot. Now look at this stuff. That's a Rhino 320. Oh, control board for the station. Check out the antenna cord going up through the floor. She would have won beauty contests in 1978, but not so much now. Okay, let's, uh, let's smash it. Or, uh, something. It just can't be functional when Olivia gets here. What do you want to use? Yeah, I could really use the opportunity to unleash some aggression here. Well, don't let me stand in your way. In fact, uh, you know, I'll just be over here. Behind you. Smash! Whoops. I guess the cult members will need to get their traffic updates from some other source now. Too bad. Look around. Let me tell well, you, where, that felt a little bit. I lied. A lot. Good. It wasn't in your shed. Oh, it's the, uh, no. the kids. You said Olivia and them. Shed. It wasn't in the we shed. Here? He doesn't keep it in the shed. Wait, Olivia, I thought we were here to broadcast the... Yes, we're here to cancel out their stupid transmitter array. The door's the open! Also fix our antenna, locking up... What was that? Uh, ah, crap. Is, is that... Riley, oh. Are you in here? Okay, let's take a breath. Take a breath? You're they have their masks off now. You disgusting piece of garbage! Do you have any Standing idea... Standing in time devotional? This building, these walls, are sacrosanct. Infused okay. with... I know you're upset, Olivia, but let's talk, okay? We're here. Let's talk. Talk? <laughs> I don't talk to earthworms. 
Earthworms wouldn't be able to understand. Understand what? What are you even trying to do? Is parentage? Parentage has no idea I'm even here. My aunt and uncle are clueless. They never approve of the ceremony. It's off chart. I'm taking it myself. Olivia. Charlie, take them down. You have your knife, right? My knife? Are you kidding me? You brought it! To, like, cut branches. Okay, whoa, slow down. <laughs> Charlie, focus up! Don't listen to their bullcrap! Come on! Uh... I really don't want to hurt anyone, Olivia. I mean, I know what I said before. This is what we talked about! Charlie, there's nobody here that can make you do anything you don't want to do. Oh, shut up! I'm not killing anybody, but give me a break! Olivia, I... I don't like this. Who gives a crap what you like? I... I don't. I'm not quitting, but... But what, Violet? So I took an extra hour to get you from the woods! Who okay, freaking... just leave her alone, Olivia. You didn't see her at Charity Point. She's had a rough night, right, Violet? I... I... Nothing has even happened yet! It's all noise and fury! They haven't fixed it! Tonight is the blue moon. Yanis yeah. is aligned. Don't you get it? This is once every ten... no, twenty years. Once this is done, we're all set. Absolutely nothing is going to... I can't do this anymore, Olivia. I'm... I'm so sorry. Finally, a teenager with some sense. What? You're quitting? Violet. In many forms of games, being out of bounds refers to being outside the available playing area and can please. result in severe oh, penalties. Please. Shut up! Right. Please. 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 Oh. Hello. Please. Oh. Enough. Hello. You. No. Triumph. You will not reach, even if we must push you out. Hey! Oh, Whoa. no. They're turning off the power. Flicking a switch isn't scary, guys. God. Okay, that's kind of scary. Oh, Olivia, what? Hey, lady. I don't know what the f*** you think you're doing here, but this ain't your house! Huh? Look, it's an ensign. What do those little triangles do again? They're keys to opening the door. Oh, great. Olivia, find, find, and see. And we can shelter you. Oh. oh Grace. Luna is speaking to us. Wait, She's getting Olivia, manipulated by them. If you both want out, then go. I know my place in this universe. Wait, Olivia, what are you doing? Fixing it. Crap, Riley, we have to stop her. Get a radio. Do I need to get up there? Whoa! Did Jack get there in time? Why, let's move! No, Olivia, this is... You're crazy I if you... the hell out of my way! Olivia, no, wait. Riley, she helped me. You... you oh, what? She talked to you before? She pretended to listen to your prattle? Wake up! I've been your friend for 15 years! But I, I went to the cliffs for you when your friend couldn't be bothered. Quiet! I... I don't know what to do! Riley, come on, get it! Out of the way! Get it? Get what? Oh, the radio! It's right there! Shit, I didn't even notice it. This is not your race. Oh, not again. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Hey, this sucks. Can we stop this, please? I see the radio. It's over... Crap, it's She's gonna Riley. get there first. Yeah, I'm going for it. This is all just Ow, fine, fine, Jesus. I think we stopped for the first time too. Get away from her. Get out. Just shake off. Oh man. There's a ladder there. Uh. Oh God. I'll be amazed by Luna's glory! What Dang do I do? Oh, you just shut your oh, trap! Yes! Change it back! It, it does what it needs to. You're only custodians. Okay. You're all so fortunate to be here. You can't control this, Olivia. Not even a little bit. Shut up! How are we going to get through the next section, though? Okay. What? Ah! No! I need this to work. 
you get a loser. No! No! This? This? It's over. All of this is over. I need this to happen tonight. It's the blue moon. I think she's trying to get her parents back, maybe. About? It's her parents. Shut up. Don't yeah. talk to them about it. It's... It's... It's none of their... It's nothing to do with them. Go on, Charlie. What's all this about? Charlie. It's her parents. It's her parents. They were part of this cult. It's not a cult! They believed in this stuff, and they died in that plane crash, and she's been living with her aunt and uncle for the last two years. It's not a cult. It's a faith, and it's real. Tonight only proves it. I don't know if tonight really proves anything, Olivia. I don't know, man. I've seen some crazy crap. What is it exactly that you believe in, Olivia? I believe sometimes it's better to just stay. To just stay? Just stay in a moment that you know won't last. But that you know is better than anything that will ever come after. Parentage believes that all time, all matter is She wants to stay in that memory with her parents, I think. And where they got on the plane? Talk to other times, other versions of you of loved ones. On certain days when the lunar veil is weak. Tonight, the blue moon. And if you give me back my radio, I'll be able to bring them back. I'll be able to live in that memory of them forever. You almost got your friends killed to hang out with people who are already dead. Not exactly an even trade. Whatever. I guess she's just showing there she doesn't care about them. On the other side, you've seen them too. They're not what you think. They can help. Help you. Help me. Help everyone. Just give me back my radio, and I'll show you. I don't think so. Where did Olivia from no one tune in the portal and smash your radio? Leave that. One more thing. These beings. I think they're the ghosts of a World War II relic. What exactly have these things said? Leave is possible. I am feeling it's hard. God, can't you just leave them alone? You know, I like you. I like you a lot, Riley. I really do. I wish this didn't have to be so hard for you. This sucks, right? It sucks. You hate it. I hate it. Nobody wants to see their friends possessed. Nobody wants to feel I'm sorry, the night's progressed to the point where I can speak a little more freely. My name's Alex. <gasps> oh! These are my friends. Wait, you're not from the submarine? The, the Canaloa? No, but they're around. Some of them, anyway. It hasn't all been us. Just mostly. Oh! Like Olivia and her friends. We went to Edwards Island, I don't know, years ago, months, weeks from now. It's hard to tell. It used to be a military base, but now it's... They got it, Ren. Thank you. We got stuck. That's the point. And now we can't get out. So we that's the ending out. where they got Just stuck, I guess? A little boost. I'm... Still unclear on how the whole thing will work? Well, Clarissa, you don't need to know how the whole thing will work. Um, what kind of boost? Riley, listen to me. You have been the arrow in my side for a while. Whenever we try to get out, whenever we get close, it's never quite worked. Never stuck. But this time it will. And do you know why? I've never tried it with Olivia. Okay, so <laughs> they want to take over the other kids. The hero of the story, Riley. Remember that. And oh, wait, her. hold on. Your plan with the transmitters? It's a good one. It is. It just might stop us. If that's what you want. Do you know what you want, Riley? Oh, this is this is wild. A million miles and a million more years just to watch you eat breakfast. Uh, 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 all right, uh, the, that, that was real, right? I was just, uh. They're teenagers. God. So we got, we have all to. All this time. Oh, this is so I interesting. Was a submarine. I thought, I thought that everything was just them. 
that they were the beings Olivia was talking to. But it's kids. Just kids. It, it, it's kids that go to Kimina High. That probably did lawn work for their parents. I, I don't know. It just changes things. If they're really stuck. And we're fighting them off? It just... It's hard to believe. It's hard to believe any of this is really happening. What? You feel bad for them now? I feel differently about it now, I guess. Ultimately, we still have to do what we have to do. But, uh, I feel less great about the whole thing. Not that I felt great about it at all, but... Okay, never mind. Garland, right? That's the last location? We should head out. Huh. huh. I guess, I mean, at least Olivia doesn't have her radio anymore. It takes a wee bit of pressure off, but we still need to finish the transmitter array. It's not over yet. Not that this was going to end any other way. I broke her radio, Jacob. What else can she do? I think this is done. She can find another one, Riley. You don't think she can cobble together some spare parts somewhere? Mm. She has a religious determination. I don't <laughs> think one broken radio will cure. Okay. Um, this That's so cool that they're playing with you. Like, if you played the first game, you have an attachment to those characters and you kind of want them to get out. And you kind of think these kids are a little bratty. But also Jacob, right? Jacob would... I need Jacob. That is so freaking clever. I love what I love what they did. But it also it it it, it plays along with like the timey wimey stuff and also it works. Like if you if you didn't play the first game, you don't have an attachment to the kids. As much of an attachment anyways. To the to the to the crew from the first game.